Okay, how do, if that work? How do you deal with hierarchy and hierarchy and power structures at work? Okay, well, um, if if a person seems to have a dominant position in the workplace and brings up stuff, and if the company structure brings up stuff, uh, i.e., you're noticing it, you know, I don't like that person; he's too bossy. I don't like where all the protocols and procedures in this company they seem um they seem to uh, controlling whatever it is hierarchy and power structures well uh is to see that you know like like Hawkins said this world I agree with him is purgatorial it, it's it, it's designed to offer maximum spiritual growth or to trigger you uh, at the maximum level for stuff that you haven't resolved within your ego so if you're put into a situation where there's bossy bosses and difficult company structures, then you accept that's your cleaning assignment, your, your forgiveness assignment. Uh, and even if you were to look into past lives, you might see a lot of these individuals. I go, oh yeah, this uh, do past life regression with a hypnotherapist. And you go, I can see now I was the boss in the past lifetime and I was bossing the hell out of this poor person and now they're back they're bossing me and uh, the only way to uh, forgive this and let it go as a pattern within my life of karmic return is to completely forgive the person for what i've done to them in the past lifetime and thereby and then once you get to that compassion and forgiveness and love you transcend the 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 positionality of finding it difficult to be around bossy bosses so you're forgiving the boss but uh Maybe in a previous lifetime, you, you developed a company which was very controlling and had so many procedures that drove your staff nuts. So you gotta, you gotta, you gotta forgive the company for that. Uh, pray for a miracle to see it differently. So uh, how I deal with it is, I just sort of sense what are the things that I have grievances, difficulty, the people. And start doing the spiritual work, you know, whether it's forgiveness, course of miracles, the observer around it. So you're trying to transcend it so that you get the miracle. Suddenly you don't notice the boss. Your boss is quite a lovely guy. And and even though in the beginning you found that all the organizational stuff was really controlling. Now you don't notice that. It's like actually this is just a wonderful group, a wonderful company with a wonderful boss and wonderful people. And they're all very lovable. And even if they're a bit defective, they're still lovable because you've transcended the resentment. You see their you see that oh well that's okay the boss is just you know he's just a little bit upset today and he's a bit bossy he's probably had a bad uh, a bad morning so you let you're able to easily let that go and go off into the flow states and uh, usually find that once you uh, it's almost like people unconsciously know when you don't like them uh, so once you get to the miracle and uh, you you've given them uh, at work uh, and you're emitting that love and compassion for your boss you often find that your boss will suddenly start responding differently to you because he uh, he he's he has his sixth sense sees that that he you know that he senses you, you don't like him it's gone and he, he now senses that you like him and you're you're his ally and his friend so the, these dynamics shift with with uh, forgiveness so i just see it as an assignment if it's a difficult work environment um that's the stuff that you know god's placed in your way to get to the next level.